Hi there, and welcome to this free session from Kaiser HIT Consulting. In this session, we're going to cover how to set up the single sign-on through uh, Cerner to get your credentials to pass straight through when the Cerner Millennium uh, logon screen appears. So let's get started. And I've actually got the screen up in front of me right now. So if you are customarily having to log in with your credentials at that screen every time, there's a quick Cerner single sign-on that can be set up once you're logged into PowerChart. So if you go to the um, blue key with the paper icon next to it in your system tray, uh, for Windows users, this is likely going to be in the lower right-hand corner of your screen with the other system tray icons. And if you right-click on that particular icon, select Logon Manager, you should get a pop-up. From there, if you'll go to File, New Logon, select Windows as the default for that radio button. In the drop-down, select Millennium Applications. You can leave the bottom two fields um, the same by default. Select Next for your user ID and password. These are the credentials that you are typically putting in the blue Cerner Millennium Power Chart screen. So once you've got those input, just click Finish and you should have a new entry in that Logon Manager screen and you can go ahead and close that window. Now to show you how this will work in the future, I'm going to go ahead and exit Power Chart. I'm back at my Citrix page. I'm going to go ahead and open via the Power Chart icon. And you'll quickly see when the Power Chart Cerner Millennium blue screen appears that it will go ahead and place my credentials into that screen and go ahead and get me logged right into Power Chart. So that's how we set up the password manager for PowerChart. Thanks for joining me in this free information session by Kaiser HIT Consulting.